Hello everybody, today is March 19th. Welcome back to another daily challenge. Let's start this game. Now yesterday was a pretty good day. So let's see if we can get 20k again today, at least. Now this is telling me somehow Africa? I'm thinking this could be South Africa or Eswatini, maybe Lesotho. These hills. I think it's gonna be either Lesotho or Eswatini. Lesotho? I don't know how you say it in English actually. Um, I think I'm gonna go for Eswatini. I remember this like trick that the L for Lesotho was for mountains that are either lacking trees or that are lush because now I can't remember which one it was so I guess we'll see in the end for now I'm going with the L for lush so green green hills basically that would make this Eswatini I'm gonna look around for any writing Mm, doesn't seem like I can find anything really so let's head on this way some more maybe we can find some kind of sign there's a sign over here let's see if we can read it oops a little bit back okay Mafube bed and breakfast. Let's see if Mafube is a town or if it even fits this style of naming. I think it could fit but I'm not seeing it here right now. I'm not seeing it. It might not be a town Let's just put it down on a road for now. And keep trying to find it. Maybe it's in Lesotho. If I can find it. Yeah, it also fits the naming like conventions here. But I'm not seeing it. So I'm just going to go for it, I guess. Oh, and it was Lesotho. Okay, so the L in Lesotho is for a lack of mountains. Okay, so the town isn't even called that. Okay, let's head to round two. We are in Japan. Okay, there's no road number, but it is a very nice looking town or village that we are. Now let's see if there's something on the back. Nope. Okay, so let's head down further here. Maybe we can find a sign that has a road number or a city name that I might recognize. Not here. Let's just keep on heading this way. Hmm. Find Japan rounds are quite hard because I have trouble distinguishing like the different regions. So if I don't find a road number or a sign with a big town name and the number of kilometers that it's away, then I'm pretty much screwed. So I'm really hoping to find something. Otherwise, I'll just have to guess somewhere in Japan. Does this crossing have any signs that I can use? It's over here. Hmm. Doesn't really seem promising. Is that a sign? Oh, there's a sign. That might be something. 
Can I read it? Not really. Get a bit closer. Okay, so we have the 222 and the 434 Nichinan Sports Park. I'm gonna look for the 222 because it's in that shape of signs that is quite visible. Let's see if we can find an area where there are the 220s. I'm not even sure if they are like, we have some two roads here, if they are numbered logically like that. Kind of it seems, but not really. What's over here? There's a 2 1. Hmm. There's some more two roads over here. We've got 20 seconds. I'm not sure if I'm gonna find it. Maybe here. There are some two roads. 218 kind of seems kind of close. Maybe here. And with a couple of seconds left, 212. Oh. Okay, so we were, oh, there it is, Nichinan. We were not very far off, which is kind of a good score actually for Japan. There's a 2 to 2. For Japan, I'm pretty pleased. <laughs> now, where are we now? Hey, is that, I saw bars on the car. Okay. So we have the bars that remind me of Guatemala. Are we actually going to be in Guatemala City? It does appear that we are. But I'm not even sure that we are in Guatemala yet. That Q could be the currency that they use in Guatemala. I think it starts with a Q, but I'm not exactly sure. So I'm going to try and find maybe a domain name or something mentioning either the city or the country. Parco Publico Lunes de Sabado might be a city name. Does this help anything? Not really, Panko. A lot of banks and medical centers around here. It does seem to be in a big city. So if we are in Guatemala, I think I'm going to go for Guatemala City this time. I mean, just like the other times, but I have a good chance. No, and a good feeling that it might actually be the city. Radio there. See with those high rises, I feel like it could actually be the capital today. <clears throat> Excuse my voice, I'm a bit hoarse. I'm still not entirely convinced that we are in Guatemala actually. But internet. There's a dot com. Okay, that doesn't help me. Does this help Lucas? Could that be like a city? I think I'm gonna go for Guatemala. I have to put my marker down somewhere. So I'm gonna go for the city. We have about half a minute left. Can I spot one of the words that I thought was a city name? So there's a few hospitals over here. Might be somewhere close by. Hmm. Maybe somewhere over here. I don't remember where we started. There's a six road over there. Oh, and it was, oh, it was pretty close by. That's quite nice. Three kilometers. That's almost a perfect score. We actually were in Guatemala. And Guatemala City. Now, where are we? Okay, this seems to be Cambodia or something based on the writing and the yellow license plates. Now, I think there's a sign over here. Hmm. 
Yeah, that does have some words, some English letters. Uh, can I read? What's that sign say? Tomoha Market. Hey, I think that it says Vientian or something here. Vientin Bank. Okay, so I think that could be the capital of Lao, which is Vientian. <clears throat> I think it could very well be that we are there. Now let's see if we can narrow it down. Maybe a street name or something on this sign. Does this help? No. It's a restaurant. Oh, this maybe does. Vientiane capital. Okay, nice. Chantaburi district. Chantaburi. Can I see that anywhere? Chantaburi. Hmm. I'm not really seeing it. What did the Sisafat Uru Asian? Sisafat Uru Asian. Uru seems French. I'm not sure if there's a French influence. Mm. Susaka. I'm not really seeing any of it. There's a bank, so we might be somewhere here, because there's Viet Bank. I think I'm gonna put it here. Let's see. See, there's that street, Rue Asian. Is there another street sign here? I can't really see one. So let's see if we can find Rue Asian. Oh, is that it? It's not over here. Let's see the angle doesn't fit. Oh, there it is. Asian Road. I think that's it. So we could be here, I guess. Maybe somewhere here. Not really sure. It does kind of fit. Mm, there's a crossing on the other side. Ah, we can't get it. Oh, 800 meters. That's quite close. Oh, I'm very happy with this. I'm very happy with this. Okay. And on to the last round. We're gonna be in Europe. Ooh. You have some nice hills. Wow. Okay, so if that's the sea or water, it's to the southish. Let's keep that in mind while we try to find the hey, there's rifts in the sky. That's interesting. Could this be Montenegro? Montenegro? Let's see. It does look quite nice here. It looks a little Mediterranean somehow. Does that buzz? Hey, that's, that says Tirane. Could we be in Albania? That they mean Tirana? Tiran something? I think that would fit. Like the hills, and yes, we have the double blues on the license plates. They have them in Albania, so that's nice to know. So I'm gonna stick with Albania for now until I see anything to disprove that. Where could it be? So the city is kind of to the north. That would mean the waters to our west. There's not really a big water near Tirana. Maybe we're somewhere here. Could we be here? I guess. Maybe somewhere here. I don't think there's that many hotels though here, right? Hmm. So where else could we be? It's more like a bay here. Does this sign say anything? Nothing that I can really read. Or that makes any sense to me. So let's see, what if we head down here? Does this tell us anything? Is 
this is sign under some kind of sign the foreign of paradise hmm 40 seconds doesn't seem to be that big of a city this way at least Ooh, maybe this sign will help us there's some flags 20 seconds Rappos Resort Hotel. So can we find that here somewhere? I'm not really seeing it. A couple of seconds left. Mm, I don't think we're here. Oh, 140. Oh, we were further south. Okay. Yeah, there's the bay. That looks way more probable. So what's the total? Ah, we just missed out on the gold. The gold is 22 and a half thousand. Hmm, that stings a bit. But it's okay, it's still a really good score. 22,000, that's very nice. So let's see, has anybody else done this yet? I don't think so. No, okay. So there we have it, another quite nice score today. I'm gonna try again tomorrow. I'll see you then. Goodbye.